welcome back to my channel. Thank you so, so much for watching today. I have a Walmart haul for you guys, obviously. You guys know I love doing the Walmart grocery pickup. I have been doing that for years. I love it. And I have to say too, that many of you have even recently said that like Walmart has stepped it up. Like they have so many vegan options now. I feel like you can actually go to Walmart, whether it's in person or through the online shopping and find everything you need as a vegan. <laughs> <laughs> specifically and be good to go for the week and I decided to go back there this week so I did the whole pickup service again super easy got in and out of there they brought it all out you can't beat it and I think that's pretty much available anywhere now uh, but I love it but I did do something slightly different this time and I want to share it with you guys I actually am partnering on this video with the drop app maybe you've already been using it and that just means I'm on the late show I don't know but the drop app you can download I have it in the description box it is completely free and I have a bonus for you guys as well on there but uh if you are not using it, it is a really, really cool app where you can accumulate rewards points just for doing your online shopping as you normally would. If that store that you are shopping at is on the Drop app, as you will see, there's tons and tons of stores, uh, you get points back. And what happens when you make your purchase, wherever that may be through, you will receive rewards points. I got 2,000 points here for just my Walmart purchase. And you can accumulate points and then redeem them for free gift cards to tons and tons of different places. I actually just redeemed, and I'm going to give it to my kiddo, uh, a Apple iTunes gift card worth 25 bucks. Pretty cool for doing what I would have not normally done anyway. <laughs> you know what I mean? And there's tons of places on there, my friends. There is, I saw Thrive Market is on there. I wish I had like known about it a long time ago and because I've made plenty of orders. <laughs> there is uh, DoorDash is on there, but there's also tons of places that aren't even like food related too, but that of course, you know, sparked my interest. But yeah, I got 2000 points just for doing my Walmart uh, grocery pickup as I normally would. There's also a section that I think is pretty cool too, where certain stores are considered stacked deals and you can accumulate extra points through your credit card plus drop points. It's really cool. So I definitely wanted to share this with you guys because it's that simple. Anytime that you're going to go on and do any kind of online shopping, go through the drop app first and see if that store is on there. And if it is, you click on the store and it'll take you right back to that store and you continue on with your online shopping and as you check out, you will redeem points and then you can get yourself gift cards. Starbucks is on there too. <laughs> and I just wanted to share that with you guys. I think it's really, really cool. Again, I have it linked in the description box and if you want to download it through that link and use my code, it will give you 10,000 bonus uh, points after you get your first thousand. So it's kind of cool, right? I like that. So thank you again to Drop for sponsoring today's video. I really appreciate it. And I think you guys will really like, you know, benefit from the app as well. And I'm gonna continue to use it. And then I'm gonna, you know, continue to redeem for some coffee as you do. <laughs> anyway, I will get right into this haul now and I will put the prices with everything as I normally do. I hope you guys are having a great, great day and I will see you guys soon. All right, so first thing I got, of course, was some spring mix. We got to get some greens back into our world. <laughs> and uh, don't get me wrong, we got balance over there. But anyway, got some spring mix here to have that on hand. We're pretty much out of lettuce right now. And you guys can see my turntables are again pathetic. <laughs> so we need to restock on some good uh, fruits and veggies, right? Got a cantaloupe here. I hope it's good. Sometimes you just never know. Uh, my last one was, so high hopes, high hopes. I also got some bananas here as well. And then I did get a three pound bag of honey crisp apples. You guys know my favorite. And I've been back on a kick, by the way, of making my uh, cereal bowls with the granola, apples, banana. Oh, so good. So good. A little bit of peanut butter and then pour the milk over top. Oh, delicious. Anyway, so got those for that in mind. Um, I also went ahead and got some more sweet potatoes. You know, the drill, I live off of sweet potatoes. They're so good. So got those. I also got some more avocados here as well. They're the little ones, which has been working out great. I pretty much eat a full one myself, um, avocado toast, super simple, love that. And they're pretty good price right now too. Avocados, I think pretty much anywhere fluctuate throughout the year, right? Where it's like, they're super cheap, affordable, great. And then other times they're like $5 for a little one. <laughs> it's crazy, but right now it wasn't too bad. I also got a thing here of asparagus. I haven't had asparagus in a while. I love asparagus. So got that, looks really fresh, really good. That's the other thing too. I've always told you guys that, 
you know, sometimes with like the whole Walmart grocery pickup where you're not actually, you know, picking out the items yourself, sometimes you wonder, are you going to get the good stuff or not? And I have never had an issue. I really haven't. Um, they'll actually let you check too if you want to beforehand and they'll swap out anything for you, but I've never had to do it. So I don't know, just give you that feedback a little bit. Uh, also got my broccoli slaw. You know, this has been a kick for me as well of doing, um, you can get this pretty much anywhere too, by the way, like Trader Joe's has it, Whole Foods has it, I think pretty much everywhere. Um, but the broccoli slaw, there's no like um, dressing in it. It's just shredded broccoli with cabbage and carrots in it. And I love to take a handful and put it on my salad greens. And that's what I use to kind of put more veggies into my salad, but they're so little and easy to chew. I always tell you broccoli, I actually really like but I don't love eating raw broccoli like big chunks of it is too much it's too hard to chew <laughs> I'm not into it so that's my little trick and I love it I also got some of these just uh, matchsticks carrots I find these are really hard to find I don't know why um, but I really like them from Walmart they're really good and again just to add it to salads as well I did get another bag here of carrots as well I'm on a carrot kick but that's actually true I really am I have been cutting these up having them prepped for the whole week and it's my snack of choice my friends i will dip it into peanut butter i will I, I know it's weird but it's delicious mustard also very very good and of course hummus you know what i forgot to buy hummus this time i have a little bit left from aldi last week but I've been back on a hummus kick. I love it. So that's been my like snack of choice lately. I got some of these mushrooms here for Nate and mine for maybe like a tofu scramble or something like that. So that's pretty much my produce. It's not like an overwhelming amount, but it'll do. <laughs> I also wanted to do Walmart this week because I wanted to get my hands on more Boca patties. I know I talk about them so often, my friends, but I just can't get enough. They're one of the original veggie burgers out there. And it's so funny because with that said, there's so many new ones that have come out and so many different flavors and what have you. And they're great. But I love these. I love the original. They are so boring, <laughs> but they're so good. And I, you just really cannot beat the macros on it, my friends. Like, look at that. Like, that's some good stuff right there. Whether you're vegan or not, too. Like, it's just good. I have learned to live off of Boca patties. And again, what I like to do is cook it up on the stovetop real quick and then chop it up into like bite-sized pieces and throw it on my salads. I love it. But you know what I wanted to mention is I remember Boca had little um, chicken nuggets and I have not seen those in months, months and months. Let me know if you have and where you have. I'm thinking possibly I might still have some hope at Winco. Winco I have not been to in months as well, but I know that they had always been a good stop for me for Boca products. Uh, so I might have to do that again soon, but let me know because I remember I have tried them in the past, those nuggets, and they're really good too. And Boca is cheap. It's the greatest thing. It's just an all around like favorite for sure. Love them. <laughs> anyway, that's my spiel on that. I got some more or organic tofu. I do have a couple bricks left from last week, but wanted to pick up a few more. I do like these two. They're like slightly bigger too. I don't know if that's really true. Like it's still the same serving size um, as most of like the bricks of tofu you buy, but I don't know. I feel like you get more in these. I don't know. Anyway, <laughs> I did go ahead and get some of shredded hash browns too. It's not a super big bag. It's just one pound, but I am excited to tell you that I think we will be able to pull out our big grill uh, again and share some more in, uh, recipes with you guys. Uh, we just haven't been because it's been so hot and smoky here, but it is getting so much better and I'm really looking forward to that. So got some more hash browns because it's the best on that thing. <laughs> anyway, I also went ahead and got one of these I can't believe it's not butter, just to change it up. You guys know we love the Earth Balance butter. It's one of our favorites. And I've recently, just to give you some feedback, have been uh, getting it over at Target. Believe it or not, Target has the Earth Balance vegan butter for like the cheapest price compared to everywhere. It's so crazy because you wouldn't think that from Target, really. And anyway, I love that. But I do, here's my, my feedback for you. I personally think the Earth Balance one has a little bit better flavor as far as butter goes, 
but I love the consistency of this one. It is super, super creamy. It's still good too, it is. Uh, but yeah, the Earth Balance one, that's kind of my only thing with it is it's very hard. And so sometimes it's hard to use if you want to do like a grilled cheese. It's hard to like, you know, coat a soft piece of bread without tearing it all up. <laughs> you with me, right? <laughs> so I got this for that in mind. Some feedback there. I also went ahead and got some of these Light Life Smart Dogs. My kiddo loves these hot dogs. I've been getting them now for years for him. He loves them and it's just a quick, easy meal. I also went ahead and got some more of these veggie tizers by Morningstar of the popcorn chicken. I believe they have these in like a buffalo flavor as well, but I got these for the kiddo too. Um, just very simple and he really likes those. I did get one can, it's kind of a big can here, I didn't realize, but of pumpkin. Um, I wanna do my oats again. I showed that to you, I think, a couple weeks ago. I'll link that recipe below as well, though, but it's a uh, pressure cooker uh, pumpkin oatmeal. It's really, really good. And <laughs> I will say, these, I swear, I swear I put five or six. <laughs> <laughs> on my cart for these kind frozen bars and I only got two so either the guy ate them which I cannot hold that against him because <laughs> I would too <laughs> or maybe they only had two and they adjusted it and maybe I messed up I don't know but what I can tell you my friends is if you find these anywhere I don't care what they cost it does not matter <laughs> they're so good so good last week I think no two weeks ago at Target, I was able to get my hands on the peanut butter version versus the dark chocolate and almond sea salt one. Delicious too. But either way, they are both good and they taste like a frozen Snickers ice cream bar. It's amazing. And they're only 180 calories each. They're not super big, but they're so decadent that it's actually like the perfect size. This is a new favorite for sure. Love them. I will tell you though, even at Target, when I got them a couple weeks ago, it was the last box that I saw there. So I feel like people are catching on and they're kind of hard to find. <laughs> <laughs> Get your hands on those. They're amazing. Um, I also got the Morningstar uh, chicken nuggets here, though. And again, it kind of is what made me think of the Boca ones. I'm like, I remember those. And they're super cheap and they're really good too. But these are great as well. They are. But yeah, it just kind of like, you know, triggered that of remembering like, oh yeah, Boca has them. <laughs> but got these. And again, for the kiddo in mind, I also went ahead and got some Gardein uh, Crispy Tenders here. My husband really likes these ones. So I just got those to have on hand. I'll give you a little feedback to that just in my experience in general. Sometimes Whole Foods will put Gardein products on sale. And then I would say it's pretty comparable to Walmart then. But Walmart's just everyday price is one of the cheapest I have found for Gardein. I think they're like $3.22, something like that. I'll put it here, of course. But they're a really good price. And I know that a lot of places, these can get up into like 5 or $6. Uh, so if you do have Walmart, stock up on Gardein products if that's something you like because it's definitely worth the price there. I also went ahead just to try it out, this Alpha Burrito, the plant-based chicken fajita burrito. Never tried this before, at least I don't recall. I will tell you in general, kind of have a love-hate with this brand. I think they have some really, really good stuff. And then some of their other items, I'm like, what did you do? <laughs> What is this? Uh, so we will see, but I've, I've been getting these recently just to have in the freezer as a quick, easy go-to when life gets crazy. And my husband will take them to work even just as a quick meal. So grab that. I also got some more brown rice. I have some white rice still, but I needed some more brown. So I got this here. It is a two pound, yeah, two pound thing of brown rice. This was new, at least I had not seen it before, but the Ocean's Halo Soy Free, which I thought was good for a lot of people that also do eat vegan or plant-based and uh, don't wanna do soy in their diet, that's gotta be tough. I just, side note there, that's gotta be hard to do both, but it can be done. And they are coming out with a lot more of items now that are soy free and vegan, which is really cool. And ginger sesame sounded totally up my alley. Looks like it has a lot of flavor. We will see, I have no idea. Idea, but let me know if you've tried it. I did go ahead and get just some of their uh, sourdough sliced bread. I haven't had sourdough in a while. I love sourdough. So good. We've been on the kick of the Dave's Killer Bread as of recently, and I love that too, but sometimes the roads just lead right back to sourdough. <laughs> you know how it is. But I also found that they, this might again not be new, but I don't feel like I've really seen this brand too much at Walmart. This Enjoy Life brand. 
I love this brand in general. Like almost everything I've tried. Yeah, I think everything I have tried from their uh, brand has been a success. Delicious. So I got these for my kiddo for uh, the week for school snacks, you know. And uh, the double chocolate brownie cookies, soft ones. Oh, I mean, I'll try to give it to him, but he's not here right now. And these are, so <laughs> we'll see what happens. But this Enjoy Life brand, highly recommend. I also got one thing here. You guys know the drill, the French fried onions. We love these. They were out of the garlic pepper flavored ones, which are like my favorite favorite, but any of them will do. It's okay. So got some of those. Love to put that onto like salads as well. And you guys know my snack of choice is popcorn. I love popcorn and I pretty much get it week to week in some form. And it's just my a snack of choice so got some skinny pop here and do you remember my friends i used to be the girl that ate one of these every single day to the point where i think it started to turn on me i was kind of like getting some stomach issues this was years ago now and uh i, I think this might have been the culprit but to be fair i was eating them every day and i don't think that's really the intent so <laughs> you know but i went ahead and got these again because i was just craving them and i love the chocolate mint builder bars oh so so good i prefer to put them in the fridge so they're hard and really hard to chew that's just how i like them <laughs> Many people might not like that, <laughs> but I just thought I'd change it up again and add these in once in a while when you just want something a little bit different. I went ahead and got just four bottles here of this Essentia water. I'm an Essentia girl. I'm one of those, but I do really, really like it. But I like to just keep this on hand for, uh, not that we're going to probably be doing it too soon with everything going on, but Nate and I like to have those on hand for if we go trail running. Uh, that's always what we take with us is Essentia water. It's got the electrolytes. It's good. You know, so I got a few of those just to have on hand. And then I also went ahead and got one more of the oat milk. I have been loving oat milk lately and uh, got the Califia Farms one, which is really, really good. So I'm glad they have that. I didn't realize they had that brand at Walmart as well. So got that. So that was my total. I really didn't go crazy, but definitely got enough to make some good stuff throughout the week. I hope you guys enjoyed this haul. Again, be sure to download Drop. I will have it in the description box for you guys. And I hope you guys have a great, great week and I will see you very soon.